pop quiz. You need some info on the Futalankasaurus, the Barasuchus, and the Dicynodon. Where do you go? Wikipedia. Thanks, Nobumichi. Oh, no problem. How do we know what these prehistoric creatures looked like? Lots of careful research and attention to details. Wait, wait how, how do you know? I draw them. Wait, really? All of them? Well, a lot of them. This is Nobumichi Tamura. Hello. And he's got a pretty cool day job. I'm working at the Advanced Light Source Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory. And my job here is to take care of this machine, yeah, this micro diffraction and station. The micro diffract what? Micro diffraction and station. Ah. But it's at night and on weekends that Nobu channels the scientific know how into his dinosaur drawings. It's called paleo art. My bad. Paleo art is an original artistic creation that depicts prehistoric life according to the latest research. Right, Nobu? Exactly. It's a combination of science and creativity, so I basically read the latest discovery on prehistoric animals. Based on that, I draw them. This is what I've been doing for the last eight years. And Nobu's got a lot to show for it. By his estimate, he's published over 1,500 drawings, including some in this book that he co-authored. But it wasn't always smooth sailing. The first drawing, that was one of a dinosaur called Casmosaurus, but it was taken out by the editors because it wasn't accurate enough. That's okay, Nobu. You can't bat a thousand. Is that the baseball reference? I'm French. <laughs> I got it. Not every baguette can be perfect. We're done here. Wait, wait, wait. Come back. Come back. Come back. <laughs> 